The Livid Guitar Wing is one of the first hardware devices to support Apple's Bluetooth LE MIDI protocol, providing a purely wireless MIDI connection to many iPhones, iPads, and Macs, with direct connection to iOS 8 phones and tablets, as well as direct connection to OS X Yosemite desktops and laptops, giving you the ability to connect your wing without having to use the provided USB receiver. This means you can get hands-on even faster. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to show you two apps that you can utilize in order to get connected directly to your tablets, iPhones, and computers. The first app is the Livid Wing FX. I'm downloading this via my desktop, but you can do it via your phone or iPad. The next is the MIDI Meter. I'm downloading that as well. Now let's get connected. As you can see here, I have the Wing, a iPad Mini, an iPhone 5, and then this is the USB receiver. We're not gonna be needing this. You are gonna need to turn on Bluetooth, whether that be on your phone, tablet, or computer. Now we're gonna do a quick setup, wirelessly connecting the Wing to the Wing WingFX app. I just clicked the button that says Reconnect Wing. Upon doing that, I was prompted for a passcode. Whenever you're prompted for a passcode, enter six zeros for the Wing. Now we're all connected. I can show you that we're getting visual feedback by pressing the wing, and that same feedback will come back on the screen of the iPad. If you're looking to verify that your MIDI is working, you can go to the Options button, where you're gonna see MIDI and audio I.O. information. Now let's quickly move over to MIDI Meter. This is an app that is going to allow you to bring in the wireless information from the wing and then route it out to other MIDI-enabled apps. Right now I'm in the Clients in the menu, and you can see the guitar wing is not connected. When I click on this, it will actually ask for a passkey. Enter six zeros once again. After the passkey has been entered, it will start to connect. Once connected, it will give you feedback that is connected, and then you'll need to navigate in the menu to Sources. Sources will then show you that the Livid Guitar Wing is available as both a source and a destination. Go ahead and click them on and then you'll be up and running to use MIDI Meter and the Wing. Now let's get you set up on your Bluetooth LE capable Mac. It's got to be running Yosemite. What you're going to want to do is you're going to go to your audio MIDI setup. Once you're there, you choose MIDI Studio and you're going to click on the icon label Bluetooth. Now you can see that it pops up a window which allows you to connect. You'll be prompted for a passkey. Once again, enter six zeros. Then you'll see that you're connected. If you'd like more information or you'd like to follow these directions in written form, please visit us at LividInstruments.com.